How you doing guys? This is Mark from Cars and Cameras and today we're going to take a quick look at the Sony RX100 Mark IV. And uh, you can see here it is, a beautiful little camera, very nicely crafted. And uh, you got your Zeiss lens on there and it's pretty nice. Uh, very similar to the uh, RX100 Mark III, but uh, one difference and that is this camera will shoot 4K video. Um, and it will shoot 4K video at 100 megabits per second. And that's why I got it and why I'm going to test it out because that's what my channel is all about is video. I'm not going to get into the still aspects of the camera. It's all about the video. And uh, you can see here, I'm going to pull this back. you got your articulating screen that moves up and down. And, and it also moves back away from the body. And uh, so you got that. And uh, let's take a look at the top of the camera here. You got your uh, controls, of course. Right now I have it in movie mode. And um, uh, a few samples that I've shot with it. Uh, I just picked it up this evening. And uh, they look really, really good. I'm going to show you some samples now. Here's a quick test, just kind of looking at the uh, wall of guitars. And um, right now I have it at uh, maximum zoom. So we're going to take a look at that, and uh, if you're looking at this in 4K, you know, take a look at the guitar strings, take a look at the knobs, you know, the detail. Now we're going to go over to another guitar and take a look at the detail there. You know, I have a I have a, a light, a halogen light hitting it kind of off to the side, so you can kind of see, you know, how it works in the shadows. Now we're going to bring it back over. And then we'll take a look at this one, the Dan Electro. And there we go. Take a look at those hats, the detail on the hats. Okay. Now, what we're going to do is something that nobody's talked about, and we're in 4K, 100 megabits per second. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to zoom this all the way in. Now what we're doing is we're in clear image zoom. So we're in maximum at clear image zoom, and um, we should have lost a little bit of resolution. So take a look at the images and go up to the hat. You know, Sony's done a great job with this clear image zoom, so this is my first time taking a look at it. So you can see from those samples that um, it looks pretty good. You know, it looks pretty good. There'll be more samples, daylight samples coming up, but you can see with that uh, that quick look of the you know the guitars on the wall, you know the video of it, of the camera it looks pretty good. You know, you can make your own judgment on it, but it's pretty cool. And uh, one other little hidden feature here is it does have this. Uh, you can see it here. The finder is mechanical. You turn it like that. It also turns the camera on. And then all you have to do, kind of hard to do one-handed, but you can pull out this 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 uh, viewfinder. So now the viewfinder is engaged. It has a uh, corrective diopter on here. Uh, I believe it's uh, like minus three or plus three. Uh, I don't have the exact specs on that, but uh, if you wear glasses, a lot of times you can adjust this so you can look through that viewfinder because kind of hard to look through a little viewfinder like this with glasses. But uh, when I have it kind of over on this end, it works for me. So anyway, um, but uh, you can see from those video samples that this is a pretty neat little camera. You can see it's pretty tiny. You know, even with the lens erected, you can see in my hand, this is a pretty small little camera. So we'll take another look at the videos again. And like I said, we are still in clear image zoom. So we're looking at everything in clear image zoom. And I'm going to pull back again, and I'm going to take it out of clear image zoom. So right now we are out of clear image zoom. So this is just the maximum on the lens itself, no clear image zoom. So 4K, 24P, 100 megabits per second. And we'll take a look at that. And obviously it should look a little softer when we were in uh, using the clear image zoom because, you know, we are, um, there is a little bit of a crop on the sensor to make that work. But like I say, on my monitor, it's looking really clean. Uh, so, but um, 
you know, have to go over the images and really take a look at them. So, like I said, here we're back to just the regular maximum zoom on the camera. And uh, we'll just take another quick look at it. So there we go. Now I'm going to move back to a little bit wider angle shot. All right. So there we go. Get a quick look there. See how that all looks. Very good. You can see from the videos that um, the camera works really well. There's you know minimal aliasing. You know uh, the images look really clean. You know I'll have time to analyze them some more, but you can see the video out of the camera looks really really good. And you know what we're talking. Look at the size of this camera. 4K. 100 megabits per second, but look at the size of it. It's pretty cool. So, you know, it's a neat little camera and you can see when you fold everything up Push that down and the camera shuts down. You know, you got a tiny little package. So there's my quick look at the Sony uh, RX100 Mark IV and Check back at my site. There's gonna be more videos coming up on it uh, Daylight nighttime. You got it. I'm gonna test this thing through and through and uh, that's it. That's the quick look at the Sony RX100 Mark IV.